Hello and welcome to What Are You Saying? Hashtag Ways, where we talk about topics in the news as it affects us all. I am Osayua Mesali, and today I'm joined by Uti Elu and Isi Fodele. Absolutely. <laughs> we get full names today. Yeah. I've been giving everybody full names since Thank coronavirus you. started. This is a coronavirus Thank weekend, you. so we have to give the full names. Fact, because it has to be mask. detailed. Where is our mask? Detailed. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, if you're going to do full names, then it's Utia Yerushawarami Edu. Thank oh you Oh my goodness, much. me. Yes. Thank you very much. Yes. yes, all 19 letters of it. <laughs> you have to get it right. <laughs> Six, have my you? EC, my EC is short. <laughs> have you been with you? It's been good. a minute. Good. It's been two weeks. Yeah, I know. I yeah, feel like so. I count my, you know, one show at a time. But mm. I've been good. Very busy. Very busy, but good. You've been yeah. too busy for us. I, I'm, I'm good. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> we'll send query to you. Hard working mom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, how's the work front though? Really good. Um, mm. There's a lot happening. I think I've been doing... Um, this year is all about... Figuring out what Uti is about, so awesome. trying to get my and strategy you look amazing. together. I love thank you. Outfit. You know me and my bright colors. Yeah, I like to. So good. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. You looking very oh, good. Oh, thank you. Me and my black colors. As usual. <laughs> Isi, how have you been though? I've been very well. Good. I'm still loving this our hair. Uh, ah, I'm so jealous. Me. I'm telling you, <laughs> I'm so jealous. Thank like, I don't you, think I can lock my you. hair. I'm so impatient. I, like, I get bored really quickly. If so. you really want to grow your hair, especially those yeah, of us that don't have hair in front. You would How want to grow it. it about seven years now. Mm. This this year will make it the seventh year. Is it easy to look after? Absolutely, totally. The beginning might be difficult, but as you go along, it gets easier. Thank you. Mm. Okay. All right. Today, guess what we found? A today's quote. While some people are busy locking hair, <laughs> <laughs> influenza pandemic must be taken seriously, precisely because of their capacity to spread rapidly to every country in the world. I've accepted it. <sighs> we prayed and we prayed. Why are we praying though, Uti? No, look, when you have faith, I mean, <sighs> what else do you do? Prayer is the key. You saw this I coming mean, now. That's what, it's no, almost inevitable. It keeps black people sane. Our faith keeps us sane. So when I say we've been praying and praying, I've maybe I should use hoping. Hoping and hoping that it wouldn't get here. But the more, um, and, and me, I'm a bit neurotic about these kind of things. I, I was following the news every single day. I'll get home and I'll go, you know, BBC, so, uh, Sky Al Jazeera. News, Al Jazeera, Al Jazeera is, is even the worst. Like, they, they give it back to back. They're not yep. even giving breaks yep. and all yep. of that. BBC oh, yeah, the speaking, same uh, as well. Well, actually, Sharon always says that hope is not a strategy. And I strongly, strongly, totally, absolutely agree with that. Look, hope is not a strategy. I agree. So we saw this thing coming. So there was, there's nothing hopeful about that. Prepare. Excellent. Even God Himself says, faith without work is it's, death. Okay. Very Let's true. Let's take it down a notch. <laughs> we can hope. We can pray. We will plan, and we will do it. But and the, the truth work. of it is, <laughs> why I say pray is because mm. when you are alone watching TV and you hear the news, your heart goes, skips. my God. Yes. And you, you really have to have something to be able to ground yourself. And I'm sorry, for us black people, yes, we faith. pray, it's our that's, faith. That's true. So I'm not, I don't have any less expectations mm. on preparedness and everything that has been happening. I mean, the who knew that the World Health, um, Health Organization website would become my new screensaver? I'm, like, I'm telling you. Like, what's happening in the world? Permanently monitoring. You know? I'm telling you. All right, so you. today's conversation is on health, on the health impact of coronavirus. Beyond the panic, we need to share right information. And we have two seasoned doctors on the show today. Um, we'll take a quick break. When we return, we'll see what we found in the news. Please stay with us. We'll be right back. 